Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Calamile Plays The Banning of Isaac Afterbirth. Uh, so, yeah, again, second save. Uh, we're just going to go on Isaac. I've had some absolutely awful like attempts at trying to do some recordings. Um, they've just gone really badly. I don't want to bore you guys with showing you. Me completely failing on like a vanilla save, or a fresh save I should say. Um, so instead, you know, we'll just keep trucking. I'm not going for like big streaks or anything like that. Um, so yeah. Uh, so we will, you know, try and do unlocks and what have you. I think this run will be going to either the cathedral or the chest. Oh, that was great damage. Um, yeah, I'm not quite sure um, where this run will end um, because we see we've still not seen Blue Baby yet. Um, I think it may trigger an ending before we get a chance to um, ascend up towards the chest out of the cathedral. Um, but we'll see. You know, obviously if it. If it allows us to do so, and we've got a run that's capable of beating the, the chest, uh, so beating Isaac and uh, all the rest of it, then yeah, we'll definitely, uh, we'll definitely do that. Um, yeah, so on this one, you know, just taking it easy, getting this this first floor done. Uh, we haven't seen our item room yet, so let's go back and have a look at that. Who knows what goodies await us inside there? A little bit of a backtrack, because obviously I went in the wrong direction there. But hopefully, there you go. Yeah, the first floors usually aren't too big, so we have managed to find it. Now let's hope there's something really, really awesome in there because so far I've been shafted with some really bad first floor pickups. Um, I've also been doing a little bit on our donation machine, just trying to build it up a little bit. Um, you know, I'm trying to get the the max level unlocked so that it's not a bit of a shit show whenever we go in there. Oh, cool. Okay, yeah, that'll do it. Holy Light's really cool. Uh, we'll use the pill. And it ended up being health up, which is excellent. Um, yeah, I think Holy Light's affected by your luck stat. And I would assume that this is probably our secret room. It's not. It's probably up there next to the shop. Never mind. With only one cent, I won't bother going in there. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's based on your luck. So if we start piling on the luck items, we'll suddenly get like ridiculous amounts of holy light shots that would be really cool um, against ragman you know it should do a little bit um, ah, not if you miss with them though that's a bit of a shame I don't like fighting ragman <laughs> he can be a bit painful especially with the number of uh, guys that he spawns um, you know if you have a screen full of like four dudes all bouncing about as they are doing currently um, you know it can get pretty annoying pretty quick Flippin' it, don't die. Uh, come on, holy light shot. Yeah, nice. He's probably gonna res them. No, he's not. Wicked. And we got another health up, so we've got an absolute ton of health. We haven't got a bomb to get our uh, tinted rock with um, if we happen to find one, um, which kind of sucks a little bit. Um, but having said that, you know, we've not even seen any tinted rocks yet. Uh, I do believe I've also got uh, Lucky Rock unlocked now. I think I got that on one of the last ones I recorded, um, which is cool. Uh, you know, the nice damage up from that. Yay! Stay the hell away from me, you fool. Oh man, that holy light shot was wasted on that little dude. That was like the biggest overkill. He didn't know what hit him, that poor little fly. Wow, nice. Whoa. Nice. Cool. Yeah, the holy light shots are coming in thick and fast right now. It's awesome. Um, Okay, we learnt from one run that I think we stand here. Yep, cool. And we did get a bomb, so, you know, the, the soonest I can get a, a tinted rock, the better, really. <laughs> that was pretty close. <laughs> I keep also, like, every single time I record... Okay, do I pop all the poop? I'm really sorry for how boring this is to watch, but I'm going to at least keep going until I get, you know, a, a few cents or... Um, you know, if I can get like a red heart or a, or a spirit heart, that'd be really good. I do apologise about this, but how are you doing? There you go, see it was totally worth it. Now we can go to our shop, buy a spirit heart, or maybe if it's got any items in there, we could get an item, which could be good, like sack boy or something like that. Um, but yeah, my fingers crossed um, I don't squander this one too badly, like I almost did then. And they keep losing the holy light shots. They, they fire, but obviously... 
they don't contact, which is really annoying because they do so much damage. Uh, we'd be really lucky to find a secret room here too. Uh, we didn't. I'm gonna open this, and we got Goat Head. So me worrying about deals with the Devils is now over. Um, we're pretty much guaranteed. Well, we are guaranteed deals with the Devils now on every single floor that we can get one. Um, which means that as long as we have the HP behind us or some way of claiming the deals with the Devils, you know, like um, credit card. I'm not even sure if I've unlocked that. Uh, perhaps I have. I don't know. Um, you know. We should be able to get everything. Explosivo as well. Okay, so this is going to be kind of scary. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Explosivo Holy Light. Does that work? Oh, it doesn't. That is a damn shame. That would be so cool to see. Um, yeah, I think we do buy Mom's Key. Um, yeah, why not? I don't have a bomb, so I can't buy it. Well, maybe I can. You know, I need two more cents. Just remember two more cents. If we manage to find that, that would be great. Uh, I mean, I don't know why I'm as worried about taking damage. I think it's just purely a survivability thing. Yep, come on. Oh, okay. That was a slight bit scary. Okay, well, why don't we shoot a few of the fires? That's exactly why we shoot a few of the fires. Man, I've been quite lucky with shooting the atmospheric items in here. And there's a little bit of health as well. And great, so we can actually buy Mom's Key. Um, so I think we will go back and do that right now. And I may even donate a cent just to say thank you to uh, the RNG Jesus. Uh, so, and thank you very much. There you go. Hopefully that appeases them enough to keep giving me awesome items. Now we won't forget about the eternal heart, but I'm not going to get it right away. Wow, okay, that dude's really fast. And he showed us our secret room, which is awfully decent of him. Nice. Ah, explosivos in that. What makes you small? That's pretty cool too. Oh, it's actually our second secret room. Well, oh God, that's so lucky. I mean, it's unlucky that we obviously lost the um, the ability to actually open it. But you know, it's very cool. Maybe if we could get like an explosivo shot on one of these guys as they're next to it. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm grasping. That was one. Yes, okay, okay. Oh, yes, I'm the greatest ever. That was a beautiful play right there. Um, so we will take that. Obviously, we'll have a few flies for the fight. Um, I'm going to be really boring. I do apologize about this, but I'm going to push these two together. If I can. Come on. There we go. Nice. Okay, see so what we get out of these. Was it worth it? I'd say so. And we actually haven't taken any damage on this floor. Um, yeah, you know what, just on the off chance that I managed to take a crap ton of damage on this one, um, I'm not going to use the Eternal Heart pick up the Eternal Heart straight away. Um, we can always, you know, come back and pick it up later. Nice Explosivo. See, it's kind of lame that the uh, Explosivo and the Holy Light shots don't like stack in a way. Um, that would be really awesome. Cool, and we get a little bit of a HP upgrade there. Well, um, Horror of Babylon doesn't do anything for us immediately, um, but I think we're gonna have to take both, uh, just because we have the health there. Cool, oh no, could have done with not having that. Well, I'll play this guy down to giving me Horror of Babylon state. Nice. Okay, he didn't. Eh, let's give him one more. Ah, it was totally worth it. Gimpy, awesome. Uh, I don't know. This may actually knock us straight out of the horror Babylon state if I pick up the Eternal Heart when we go down. I can't remember if it gives you a full Red Heart container or not. Um, but we're pretty much done on this floor. We could try and look for our secret room, but we've only one bomb. Um, I think it's probably better saving that for something else later on. And. Yes, so we're now at one and a half, so if we can figure out a way of getting back down into the Horror of Babylon state, that'd be really sweet. You've got to be looking at this run and thinking, pretty damn powerful right now. Um, you know, I'm not really sweating it about health so much. I mean, maybe if I keep taking dumb damage like that. Um, Hierophant, no longer worried about the health again. Uh, you know, let's just use the star card straight away. Yeah, it's pretty good juicy sack, I suppose. Gives us the occasional spider and what have you. I mean, Hive Mind would be pretty good as well here, as well as um, 
amazing, obviously. Other guppy items would be great. You know, if we could actually become guppy on this run, I think that would be you know, pretty much cement a victory here. Um, although it's not looking too unlikely that that will happen anyway. Um, although I probably should stop speaking too soon because I keep taking damage whenever I say that the lo run's looking good. It's just sad to <clears throat> Oh, that one just kept growing there. All right, got in there, nice. And last one, sweet. Uh, did anything drop there? No. Okay, we just did a random little circle of that area there for no apparent reason. Nice. Okay, well that's good to know. Can always use that in the future. Cool. Uh, we've got plenty of health as well to take a deal with the devil. Although, since we've just unlocked Krampus, it's looking pretty likely, I bet, that we do get a Krampus fight here. Um, that would just be too funny for the game to pass up the option to do that. Um, for itself, obviously, I'm not going to be laughing. I'll be mildly amused, maybe. I might chuckle to myself, but I'm not exactly going to be jumping for joy. But let's have a look. We did get a look up the road there, which is cool. Oh, wow. And we can take all of these. So, yes, please. Thank you very much. Lovely stuff. Thank you. Our damage has probably just gone through the roof. We're one item away from a guppy. Uh, yeah, let's just go down. Uh, Could have gone to the shop with 19 cents, but you know what? Maybe we can actually make the boss rush. I mean, God, if there's ever a run that can actually beat the boss rush, it's this one. So let's, you know, it's not power on ahead, but uh, yeah, we will blow that up and get across there. Why not? Um, you know, uh, okay, it's a dead end. Cool. I would like to get some boss rushes done, um, you know, without sweating it too much. Um, if, if this is one that's going to allow us to do that, then by all means, I will fight all the way through it. Um, you know, all we need is a guppy, another guppy item, and we are there, we are set. Yeah, it kind of sucks, kind of slows us down a little bit. I mean, we've got, we're at 11 minutes and we're on Flooded Caves 1. I mean, we're yeah, ever so slightly behind, probably about 30 seconds. I mean, the fact that I've got to pick up so much stuff every time I open a chest doesn't help. Um, but then that's Mom's key working out for us, actually. Um, Cool. We'll kill this dude. He's got explosivo on him, so I'll kill everything there. Um, again, like looking for a way of getting down Hor Pavlon. Jesus Christ, um, that was a hell of a lot there. Um, yeah, if we can figure out a way of getting out into Horror of Babylon, um, you know, getting stacking a shitload of damage, and um, that may be one way that we can secure boss rush for us. Just how many explosivo shots do you need attached to your face? That was quite intimidating. Him just jumping towards me as like the sacrificial lamb right there. Okay, we got explosivo doing good stuff here. So maybe, yeah, like the look based upgrades as well are going to be pretty handy for us. One left? What is it? Where is it? Ah, it's a silkworm. He was sneaky, he was blending in with the background. Keep on exploring here. So we want to try and find our item room. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to worry too much about starting to rush. I'll know closer to the time if I need to really start getting a move on, and then I'll start skipping stuff. Um, right now, it doesn't seem worthwhile skipping uh, too much because obviously we've still got quite a lot of uh, stuff we could end up picking up that could make our characters so much stronger. Um, been quite lucky with curses as well on this uh, on this run. We've not really had too much in the way of shenanigans happening, uh, you know, throwing us into wrong rooms or not being able to see what our items are that we're picking up. Okay, lovely stuff. Let's just try and find that item room while we're here. It's not going to be this way. It's going to be some pretty serious backtracking to get back to the item room, I feel. Um, okay. It's probably left on that big room, so I will go check it. Um, you know, speed upgrade to try and uh, make the most of our time here. Yeah, I, th I think we're going the right way here. Okay, tons of explosivo in there. Nice. Possibly a secret room. Usually is. Yeah. This may actually give us access to an adjacent room that's something that we might want to access, such as an item room or shop maybe. Yep. Oh, fat odd mushroom as well. Great. So that's uh, quite a big damage upgrade there. I mean, we're killing stuff. 
remarkably quickly here. Yeah, I think this is definite uh, boss rush candidate uh, right here. It's a shame that we did get a greed fight. Um, probably not going to get a chance to use all this money that we've built up, and I would love to give all of it away to our donation machine just to get it, you know, sitting nice and filling the coffers with uh, all that lovely money that we can start cracking into when we do future runs on, say, you know, Keeper or The Lost or whichever we happen to uh, want to do first. Uh, Gertie Cool will put down a bomb there. You know, Explosivo, once they start cranking out like that, it's just going to absolutely wreck Gertie. As well as the Holy Light shots every now and then are quite powerful against Gertie. Um, wow, that's a lot of Explosivo. And we are done. Uh, let's see what our deal with the devil contains this time. I will not use the help. Um, okay, uh, I mean, we may as well... I really want flying, but I also really want the pact, and the pact doesn't really lose much health because you do get a couple back, and then we'll be back on there. Um, so we do have flying now, which is great, which means any you know detritus on the floor we can just sidestep all that. We can just say thanks, but no thanks. I'm just gonna skip that. Wow, look at all those explosivo shots stacking up. Beautiful. Why am I picking like everything up? So we got we're at 16 minutes. We are on we're on the curve. We're not exactly directly ahead of it. Um, you know we've got a little bit of uh, a way to go till we get to get to boss rush. But I think we should be able to make it. I think we can start rushing if we get to like, the last floor and we're like you know we got an explosive shot. No, we didn't stick an explosive shot. No, okay, we did that. Excellent. Oh, I didn't get that guy. Go 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 go. Ah, okay, there we go. Cool. Nice. Flying's just so helpful. As soon as I get flying, I just feel so much more comfortable with what I'm doing. And, I mean, obviously this amount of damage as well is pretty disgusting. I don't really want fruitcake. I'm not the biggest fan of it. Cool. Oh, well then. Um, i tell you what, let's get the compass and then donate everything that we have or that it will take. I think if we get to 50, do we get something? Well, there's options. Nice. It's a good one to have. I mean, we won't get all the way up to 75. I'm not sure if there is anything at 75. This is really eating into our time right here. Um, so, you know, I'd appreciate it. Okay, cool. Uh, we'll buy that death card. Why not? Um, oh, do I want fruitcake? Yeah, screw it. Let's get it. The occasional god headshots and stuff. We just need to be making sure that we're not, you know, killing ourselves on the uh, on the Ipecac shots to a club. So might as well just pop. Uh, we'll do this one really quick. Okay, we did get a black heart out of it. Let's keep on moving. We can now see as well where our boss fight is, which is really super awesome. And um, again, that's like you know, if we do need to rush down um, to get to boss rush, excuse the pun, then you know we really can. We can just jet there. Uh, we can skip as much as we want. We can use you know the 33 bombs so we can break the hell through as many doors as we need to in order to get there. Uh, no secret room, it's probably on the left. Uh, the cage, not a great fight, but you know, we're doing that much damage as long as he doesn't jump too much. Um, yeah, those explosivo shots are just gonna absolutely wreck his face. Beautiful, We've got Binky there, and Dead Cat. We are now Guppy, um, and I think as well, we might as well take that because then we get into Horror Babylon, we'll just do disgusting damage. Let's go. Okay, so now it's just basically a face roll all the way down through boss rush through every single floor. Whereabouts are we going? Maybe we go up. Yeah, we'll go up. I regret going up. Cool. And we get Steven, just, you know, for the hell of it, why not? Um, this is just great. Uh, you just waste a key, why not? Um, I may have to start rushing in a second. I may decide that we don't want to, you know, try and find our secret rooms or anything. Not that I've been doing particularly well at finding them anyway, but um, yeah, I can't even see what's going on with our tears. They're just insane. Um, let's see. Flush. No. Doctor's remote. No. Mini mush. Daddy long legs. I do want. Okay, cool. I mean, that's, an, again, another great boss rush item. So um, we will definitely now make haste to the boss fight. Um, we want to get in there. There's plenty of time to spare. That was dumb. Don't do that. Uh, okay, okay, nice. Got plenty of speed as well. Um, 
Obviously the flying upgrades that we've got and everything is just giving us tons and tons and tons of movement speed. Uh, cool, excellent. Um, this is not the way to our boss fight, is it? Yeah, it must be. Pretty cool. Uh, let's check out the double key room. I won't re-roll anything. Uh, let's just use a bomb there. And uh, Oh my god, okay. Wow, <laughs> that was stupid, but we now have a ton of items there. Uh, okay, we've got a minute to go, so... Oh god, stop. I mean, we have got gum uh, Gimpy, so... You know, we should be able to see what's in our shop. Uh, shop recycle. I'll tell you what, we'll buy that. We could have bought the shop recycle. No, why would we do that? We wouldn't need to do that. Let's go. We have 45 seconds to get to mom. Assuming we are on the floor that I think we are. Uh, you know what, I'm just going to bomb my way out of here. I, I do want to make sure that we get to boss rush. Cool. Okay. And then these guys... Cool. 30 seconds to kill Mum. Should be plenty of time. Wow! Okay, those holy light shots are quite literally ridiculous. So we don't actually have a choice. Oh god. Head of Krampus, fine. That's cool. Yep, great, 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 great. We do need to get out of here though. Okay, um, I mean, yep, we do need to take one of them. So common cold it is. Um, yeah, we'll just base roll the hell out of this. Um, it shouldn't be too tricky. Um, you know, we've got so many upgrades right now, and I've lost track of how many you know, DPS improvements we've had. Um, so we'll just, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we'll try not to run into the stain too often, and that's not advisable. God, these like weird oblong tears that I've got are quite bizarre, especially when they stick to things. They look a bit mad. Um, okay, brownie. Things shouldn't be too tricky, although you have spawned a ton of things, and I've can't really see what's going on right now. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. We did get another charge there, so that's the end of that one. There we go. I mean, he's, I just, what's going on? <laughs> There's so much crap happening right now. Okay, there we are. I mean, it doesn't help that our character is like super dark, so they just blend into the background like really well. All I can really see is where the tears are coming from, not not where my actual character is. Um, coupled with the fact that our tears are just a mess of rainbow madness, um, it's kind of sick-inducing, actually. Um, also, what's sick-inducing is the rate at which we are actually killing enemies is quite hilarious. Um, where did you go? Can you jump again? Oh, you jump again. Okay. I mean, we're just spawning flies. With you know throwing out just ridiculous amounts of damage. Um, oh, wow, well, okay, where did that come from? Hello there, Death. How are you doing? Let's kill Gish. He's nearly dead. Thankfully not getting owned too much by the um, Ipecac shots. What's this then? Okay. okay, I mean, we're not losing... We are hemorrhaging a little bit of health. Ah, okay. We are hemorrhaging a little bit, but, you know... I'm not overly concerned. We do such a disgusting amount of damage. Um, I mean, Pin, I didn't even fire at him. He just decided to die. That was quite funny. Um, one of these is, has surely got to be the blow, which is probably going to catch me off guard. Um, and obviously, the amount of money that we're just getting dropped here. You know, we can't even do anything with this amount of money remaining. Oh, he just decided to die. He's like, nope. Fuck that, I'm out of here. And we must be getting close now. I unfortunately didn't start counting up the number of uh, of rounds we've done. Cool, Isaac's head has appeared in the basement. Excellent. And, you know, just to top it off, why not just give us Polyphemus? It means we won't be firing as often, but um, I should think that we would do just a disgusting amount of damage. Um, I can't even pick stuff up, I'm moving that quickly. This is where, like, all the upgrades and stuff that we've actually picked up is just going to work in against us because I'm now going to end up having to fight to, you know, stay on track and stay on course. I think just screw it. Let's just go all the way down to... Oh, you know what? Polyphemus probably not the best pickup. I don't know. It does mean that our flies are just going to be just stupid. It's odd, though. We're two-hitting some stuff. It just doesn't instill, like, the most confidence. Again, ton of consumables that we're probably not going to get to use. It didn't look to me um, by the 
virtue of the fact that we picked up Grow Fox, yeah, she's deaf, um, that we're actually going to get a chance to go up to the cathedral. Unlock Kane, cool. That must mean I've picked up enough uh, coins or something in a run. Perhaps, uh, Mama Gertie, but yeah, I probably fired two shots. Me, cool. Uh, it does mean we have a way of paying for a deal with the devil. Uh, Spirit of the Night, or... I know, let's get Spirit of the Night, maybe we get Leviathan. We did get Leviathan. I don't think it does anything for us at this point, but... Cool, let's just keep going down. Yeah, I think this is also going to end at Mum's Heart. Um, I think maybe it's three Mum's Heart kills that you have to get in order to uh, unlock the cathedral. I mean, that is a bit of a shame. Um, I didn't even check which way we were meant to go there. Yeah, maybe you've got a donation machine. You do not. That's me. Yeah. Shame. I mean, honestly, what do we want from our cursed room? Oh, I do know. I did end up going the right way, despite having mapping and being able to check. Cricket's head, why not? I'll just add to the absurdity. Um, I feel like it's not even worth checking for, like, secret rooms. Oh, great, a skeleton key. It means we can get Bob's brain for free. Hmm, no. Uh, it's Mum's heart again. <laughs> Well, there you go. That was a quick enough kill, was it not? Oh, we can go down. Yeah, let's go down. I don't think we can go much further than killing Satan, but we did just unlock Rubber Cement and Mama's Boy because we didn't kick it on that last bit. That's funny. Um, we just got a ton of unlocks there, obviously, uh, even Samson. Um, so that's half the character page unlocked already. Um, Let's just keep getting one makes you small. Let's just make ourselves ridiculously tiny now. That's so cute. Um, I mean, that's quite cool that we managed to get that achievement there of not getting hit on the heart. Uh, maybe we could, if we could do that on there, on this round as well, that'd be really cool. What's that pill do? I found pills. Harmless enough. It's just silly. Oh, we're not going the right way. Damn it. Okay. Back this way we go, I would assume. I'm sorry for doing like a bit of a speedy clear here. Um, obviously, I just want to get these runs kind of bashed out now. Um, you know, start getting the unlocks that we might need for uh, further completion. I mean, ultimately, you know, I'm, I'm kind of gonna go for a thousand and one percent. God knows how long that's gonna take me, especially considering it's a completely fresh playthrough. But you know, we'll try. Um, it may take me. Forever. I may never get there, who knows, um, but I feel it's it's a fun little project that I can uh, I can work on. You guys can maybe join me and uh, share the fun, share the ride. Whoa, okay. Uh, I tell you what, let's just... Oh, you've got flying. That's good. Well done. Oh, we managed to get hit. That sucks, the big one. Oh, well. Satan. Three. Two, one, bomb, run. I mean, not that we really need to. I mean, have you seen how quickly we just killed the Fallen? Um, I don't know how I dodged that. I couldn't see it incoming. So, um, I wonder if we killed the foot in like one stomp. Yep, pretty much. Sweet. Um, I think that's it for this run, unfortunately. Yeah, we're not going down any further. Uh, that's a bit of a shame. But uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm actually genuinely proud of that run. That was. A lovely run. Uh, pretty much commentated itself. Like it was just item after item after item. We, you know, I got given that on the plate. It's a shame we didn't get a chance to go up to the chest and finish off Blue Baby. Obviously, we still need to kill Mum's Heart in uh, one more run, I think, to get everything unlocked. But uh, yeah, you know, uh, please leave a like and a thanks if you enjoyed the video. And uh, obviously, any comments and criticism are much appreciated. Thanks very much for watching guys and I'll see you next time. It's Cal Miles signing out.